excited to bring it to you. Along with Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Let's get ready to play this one. Moments away from puck drop. Ray, give me a sense of what's the difference with an American League clash to the NHL. Well, there's a couple of things. One, of course, is the level of play is a little different. The American League is a little more scrambly. The game is a little more frenetic. But there's also the fact that you're playing not only for your team, but for yourself. You want to be noticed so you can be an NHL player. Setters glide into position for the opening draw. The Americans start with possession as we are now underway. And that's deflected. Wheeling's got the puck. Looking dangerous as they move along the boards. Moves it quickly over to Hood. Slotted aside by the blocker. Dell's able to make a save look really easy. Now he doesn't have to deal with the rebound either. The Americans move it in. To the low slot. And reads the play perfectly and picks off the pass. Across the line from center. Here's a chance. Whoa. Fires the wrist shot. And that somehow stayed out of the net. Yeah, I hated when I missed chances like this, James. You don't get many that are this quality. You want to put them away because you don't know when the next one's going to come. Oh, it stops him again. And he slides it quickly to Hood. Takes the pass. Moves it to Hood. Aaron pass, and they can't connect. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. And that was stopped. The Americans gain possession in their own end. They're picking up steam through the neutral zone. Drives to the paint! The Nailers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Puck battle along the boards. Wheeling's got a hold of it along the wall. Here they come up along the wing. From the slot, wrist shot. Oh, it stays out. He got a piece of that one. the midway mark in this period. Still scoreless in this one. Rochester's won the draw. Quick pass to Bacar. From the left side, they gain the zone. Takes a shot, and that's turned aside by Guidon. Oh, what another save! Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. Into the offensive end now. Let's it fly! That's kicked away with the pad by Dell. McKinnis has it along the boards. The Nailers have it from their own end. Grabs the puck. Takes the feed from the wing. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. The Americans get a hold of the puck along the boards. Pushes it across to McKinnis. Gaining steam here on the attack. Drives it to the crease. Tremendous stop by Guidon. Uh, he's going to feel he missed one there. You don't get many chances that clean. The goalie turns it aside. Wheeling's got a hold of it against the wall. The Nailers are on the attack. Snaps it on net. With a glove, great reflexes there. He makes the glove stop right from the slot. That's a dangerous chance. It's a good thing he showed up on time. There's another stop. He's bailed his team out early. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Let's it go. Oh, that's blocked. What a stop by Dell. There's the horn bringing period number one to an end. Still no score in this one. As both teams get a breather here in this first intermission, we'll do the same and get ready for period number two. All right, I think my partner in crime, Ray Ferraro, is rested and refreshed. 
along with the teams. We're ready to get things underway. Still no score in this one. We'll see if period number two finds ourselves a goal. Well, we've got over 20 minutes played thus far. Ray, how have you seen things? Man, that was slow, James. That first period, nobody generated any offense. Just a few shots to test the goaltenders. Scooped up along the wall by Biro. Wheeling's got the puck along the boards. Here's a shot. Oh, tremendous athletic reflexes there with the toe stop. The Nailers will play it from the defensive zone. Along the half wall with the puck. Takes the feed. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. Those are the saves that are gifts from the goaltender. That looked like an automatic goal. He's able to make the stop. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. The game is still scoreless. Rochester's won it. Down the right side and into the zone. Here's a chance in front. Fantastic save. And there's another stop. He's like a backboard in there. Bang, bang. The puck's off him twice. He makes two stops. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Fails to find the open man. Picard's gaining momentum. Shot. Oh, a clutch save. Here's a short pass to McPherson. Sends a pass over. Here's a shot. Oh, and cuts up with nothing on the play. It's in. He scores. You've got to get rid of that puck in a hurry from that spot on the ice. You're in the high slot, you're open, but you know everybody's converging on you. I like a lot of their game, but it's like they can't get these other guys to go away. It stays close, but at least they're playing from in front. And now he tries to get it across to Mersh. Let's it go! Oh, there's a great stop by Guaidon! It's in the back! And we've got ourselves a new game! Always amazes me, James, how one shot changes everything. Now this game is even. Nice play. Quick pass on the tape and into the net. So quickly the goalie can't get closed up and make the save. Past the halfway mark of this period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. The Nailers looking against the half wall. Let's the wrist Whoa. fly. Made the save on the play. Now he takes it over the line. The Nailers look to start the transition game. Wheeling got him along the wall. Nice pass. Hard hit on the play. Wow, did he ever finish him hard. And when he dropped... He also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. Takes the feed. Oh, great save by Guaidon. Save is good. Better yet that that rebound doesn't stay in front of the net. It's over to safety in the corner. Oh, and that's got the crowd fussing after that stop. Nice feed from the left side up the middle. Oh, denies him with the save. I think he got the blocker on it. Oh, up the post. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. The goalie's got to stay sharp and does so with a really nice save. That's a good scoring chance that was generated and a good shot taken. Here in the late goings of the period, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Here's a chance to set up now. Takes a shot. 
Wheeling's playing it through the neutral zone. On the attack along the boards. Misses over the net. Hit the net. No chance to score if you don't get the puck on target. Nice zone entry from the middle. Takes a wrist shot. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. I need to take another look at that. I thought there was room to get by. Clearly, I was wrong. I'm glad I don't have to take the hit he just took. Center's gliding up to the face-off dots here. Rochester's won the draw. Looks like there's a delayed penalty being called here by the officials. The Nailers have been handed two for interference. Ah, gonna be tough to argue that one away. He just stopped him dead in his tracks but he doesn't have the puck. The Americans will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. It's been a really good game tied right now, but the top power play in the league gets to go to work for the first time. It's been a tightly contested affair this far as the period comes to an end. It's just moments away. Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. The Nailers win the draw and get their penalty killing unit off to a good start. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Slides the puck to Rustalainen. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Trying to get it out of their own end. And a nice job by the Killers on that one. Yeah, now they can get a change, get some fresh players on the ice. Rochester's got it against the boards. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Rustalainen. Ten seconds left! To the front! Rochester's power play expires. Go, 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 Both go. sides back to even strength here. And we are still tied. Really good pressure by the penalty killers there to keep this game tied. They tie up the power play in pretty nice fashion there. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. From point blank go. range! And he denied that opportunity. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Through center along the wing. Hare's got it along the wing. Here's a chance. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece Line of that change, one. Hurry. I thought they worked the puck around pretty good. Here they get a good chance on goal, but not to be. Handles the puck. Denies him. Back to the blue line. And he takes a shot. Great save by Guaidon. The Nailers will play it in their own end. Into the offensive zone. Here's a shot off a stick. Rochester's moving it along the wing. The Larry. Nailers have it against the wall. Here he is, shot right in front. Made the stop on the play. Gets a hold of the puck here at his own end. Great poke check on the reach. Quick feed to Biro. Driving right to the front. And the deadlock is broken. Well, what a crushing goal to give up. But the other guys work hard for it. They pressed the play, and now they've got the lead. Now coaches talk about getting to the front of the net, make it difficult on the goal to take his eyes away. Man, he only can see the player's butts in front of him. He can't even see the puck. The 
Americans have been in a dog fight tonight, and they have finally scratched and gone ahead. I don't think the fight's over yet, and they're going to have to play aggressively and not be too conservative as there's still some time left. McKinnis carries the puck in his own zone. Receives the pass. Right in the slot. That's off a stick. Wheeling's got the puck in the defensive end. Slides it back to the blue line. Can't get it to go. Can't find his man. Rochester's got a hold of the puck now. Cutting to the slot. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Battling for it on the boards. The Nailers move the puck in the defensive zone. Scoop it up along the boards. Through center. Gains the zone from the right. Wrists one. Oh, he got a piece of it to keep it out. Rochester's got possession of the puck. Stopped by the goaltender. From the right side, takes the pass. Gains the zone through the middle. Chance right in front. Wheeling's emptied the net. The extra attacker's now out on the ice. Takes lines, come Fires on! Fires to the empty net. The Nailers gain possession along the wall. Streaking into the attacking zone from the right. The Americans grab possession to the puck. Tries to get it to the car. That pass doesn't go. Wheeling's got the puck along the wall. That's a good play at this stage of the game. No reason to take a chance. Just dumps it into the offensive zone to kill a little clock. Simple stop by now. And that's all she wrote on this one as we are in the books. Well, they get the win and really control many of the small areas of the game. They were good in the faceoff. Their center ice position is such a strength for them. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Zabalski. We'll see you next time we drop the puck.